Nobody likes seeing cars speeding through a neighborhood where young children live, but in one Valley neighborhood, it looks like someone is going rogue in an effort to stop it. As 13 Action News reporter Gina Lazara tells us, they've made their own speed bumps. During school hours, Radwick Drive on the far east side has a speed limit of 15 miles per hour. During every other time, it's not much faster than that. But people living in the area say those speed limits are definitely not respected. The dogs bark a lot, and I, I, I usually say somebody must have been speeding. Rich Caraba has seen people not just speed, but race down his street. And then uh, they go uh, as quick as possible speeding, as fast as they can floor it. So it appears somebody took matters into their own hands, making their own speed bumps out of giant rocks. If I saw that, I would not be happy. One neighbor tells 13 Action News there was not just one makeshift speed bump on the street, but two. That's a crime in itself. A woman on Facebook says she came across the rocks over the weekend while she was driving. So she pulled over, picked up the rocks, and pushed them to the side so no one else would hit them. Rich is thankful for that. I would either have to uh, stop and, and move them myself, uh, for I was in a rush and couldn't uh, stop uh, uh, to move them. Uh, I probably would have just backed up and uh, you know made the illegal U-turn because of that and uh, go down Washington. Neighbors also tell 13 Action News they are not sure the person who did this was trying to cause harm, but they never want to see it happen again. On Radwick Drive, Gina Lazara, 13 Action News. People living on Radwick tell 13 Action News they've tried for a couple of years to get speed bumps, but the county denied the request because there's a school on the street and they say it would pose a hazard for emergency vehicles.